Hungarian style beef stew. Using the Instapot saute setting, heat one tablespoon olive oil. Add the cubed chuck roast seasoned with our peppercorn beef rub. Loaded with a good deal of peppery flavor, our peppercorn beef rub features black, white, green, and pink peppercorns. It's also salt-free and sugar-free. Searing the meat will enhance the savory flavor and finishes the dish with complex flavors of nutty and coffee-like bitterness. If you like your stew thick, you would also want to dredge it in flour before searing. Be sure to scrape off all the flavorful bits off the bottom before adding the vegetables. Adding celery, bell peppers, carrots, and turnips. Winter root vegetables work well in a stew. It's a hearty stew, so chunky sized vegetables will ensure they don't cook up too much. We chose the addition of turnips because they have a great bite, peppery flavor that pairs well with the peppercorn beef rub. Overall, they lend a more complex flavor layer than your basic potato. Rutabagas or parsnips would also be a great choice as well as butternut squash or acorn squash. The best choices in vegetables would be ones that cook well under pressure cooking. It's time to add the tomatoes and beef stock. We use diced tomatoes, undrained in their juices. Here at Spices Incorporated, we like to have control over salt and sodium intake. Choose no salt and low sodium tomatoes and beef stock if you're using canned. If you're able to prepare your own beef stock, you will have even more control as to what is in it. Beef broth would also be a suitable substitute. Adding one bay leaf, caraway seeds, and Hungarian paprika. If you add paprika and caraway too early in the cooking process, they will become bitter. Add Worcestershire sauce and mix well. It's time to start pressure cooking. Put the lid on the Instapot and lock it in place. Make sure the steam release handle is set to seal. Then turn on the meat stew setting for 45 minutes. This will cook the stew quickly using high pressure. If you're used to cooking with older style pressure cookers, you may be amazed with the Instapot's performance and ease of use. When the 45 minutes are up, use the quick release method to release the pressure. Use care during this step, we are using high pressure here. Serve the stew with spatzel, some crusty bread, and garnish with fresh parsley. If you want to find this recipe or any of the seasonings used, visit our website, spicesinc.com, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.